Okay, you know how you get ideas about things? Well, this is an idea that I got from looking on Instagram. I have an Instagram male artist friend who lives in Columbus. Her name is Kathy uh, Merle Bennett. And she made some beautiful dioramas using little cans this size. The ones she used were sardine cans. And I thought, you know, I want to do that. So I've been saving some cans. This is kind of gives you an idea of what you can do, although this particular gnome is not going to be going into this sardine can right now because, well, he just wants to be somewhere else. But anyway, these are actually mackerel cans because they're the same size as sardines, but they're mackerel. This one is just a kind of a plain one. I think there was also mackerel in this one. But anyway, I'm collecting these. And then this is another can that I might use. I'm not sure. I ordered this online. It's another type of mackerel. It came from Japan with some different flavors in it. So anyway, so yesterday, Jason and I go to Dollar Tree. Just leave him in here. And I just thought I'd get a few things for... Um, little dioramas in a can. So this is the first thing I got. These are um, farm animals. I'm just going to take a look right now. Of course, you know, everything at the dollar store, or most everything, is a dollar twenty-five. I'm still kind of not over it going up from a dollar, but you do what you can. So what do we got in here? So that looks like a calf or a cow. There's two of those. Um, these are smaller spotted cows with horns. And the tail making a loop up the side. Mm, horses with some issues, I think, with their legs are not exactly straight but these are kind of flexible I think they're you can bend them or whatever but yeah two horses and uh, yeah so I guess there's kind of like two of everything but uh, those horses don't stand up okay two goats that's right Two goats with beards and horns, and I think those do stand up. Two pigs, nice little pigs. Um, one collie, I guess, to herd all of these smaller animals. Oh no, two collies, sorry. Two big or nice brown collies and two rams with horns you know they can fight and two regular sheep so these must be ewes like female sheep and anyway there you have it that's so for $1.25, I get a whole farmyard of animals, and they all pretty much stand up except for these horses, which I have a feeling if I adjust them, they probably would stand up. This one just has some medical issues, but whatever, it's okay. There, I think I could make him stand up too. So that's... Okay, that's what I got for that those things, and these were called farm animals, 16 pieces, and then in French, animaux de ferme, I don't know, I'm guessing. Okay, so that was the first thing, plastic farm animals, which, you know, a lot of possibilities with these. I mean, just imagine the things, imagine if you can, the things you can do with 
little plastic farm animals when you're making a diorama. It's crazy. Okay, that was the first. Now the second one, I got kind of excited about its marbles. These are uh, 24 marbles. They kind of look like the old cat's eye marbles. There's even a big one, a shooter, in here. And there's different colors. And maybe I will just get into these. Let's take a look. I could just have them roll all over the place, but no. So anyway, I just tore a hole in this. Okay, there's the shooter marble. See it better. Yep. And then there's uh, blue, green, orange, and yellow. I think this, that's it. So, well, whoops. So there's that. <laughs> Clearly, I just wanted marbles to roll around. <laughs> but anyway, there they are. Marbles. $1.25 at the dollar store. And then the last thing I got, which is kind of thrilling, is googly eyes. Because a person can never really have enough. Now, these are a couple different sizes. It looks like there's some big ones and mostly a lot of small ones. And, uh, I mean, the possibilities are just, you know, it's hard to, it's hard to contain the joy of googly eyes. Let's see if I can get into the bag. But, yeah. So, let's see, you can just take a couple of these and put them on something, put them in a can. Boom. Oh, what is that? I don't know. Okay. Anyway, that's my story. That's my collection of things for dioramas from Dollar Tree.